Now let's see if we can catch us something. Yeah. Here we can't catch us any more. But I'll scoop up some water first. Oh, I seen a fish come up over there. What was that? Huh? Well, this isn't that big a cast net. Big ones you can. Are they? Goose egg. Oh my God. You mother freak. He got him. He got him, Daddy. Got him. I know you did. No. Oh, God. No. no. Guys, we might not be fishing for nothing. It smells like butt here. Well, I might not catch a darn thing. Hudson, we gotta go over here. Yeah. Let's not lose the net. Oh. Oh, I got one. Yeah, yeah right. Oh, perfect. Good job, mate. Now you get to get the out. All right, let's catch another one. What is it? It's a bluegill, Dad. It is a bluegill. Good job. Shing! Oh, shed. All right. Oh, Daddy! That's a shed! That's one of those big sheds! Woo! Now we got some variety. Let's give him some more water. Yeah. Let's not fall in this though. All right. Cash net him. Okay, good. Oh yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, we got the river monster juice right here. Woo! Woo! I kind of feel like I should quit while I'm ahead and not throw my, cause there's so many snag points out here and rocks. All right, we're gonna sit in the shade and chill. Try to catch us a river monster. Simple rig right here. Hook them right through the... I don't know if I should do tail or back. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, you're not gonna catch anything. Hey, you never know. We need a good setup. All right, I'm gonna loosen that drag so I don't rip this pole out. You should. I want the shad though. Okay. That one's my pole. This one's acting dead for some reason. Okay, so we're set. We're just gonna watch. Maybe something will happen, who knows. Okay. Uh, if I had to guess, I would think a turtle action got on yours. Get him, Hootie! Get him, Hootie! Let me see it. Get him! Oh, you're hungry? No. I ain't even going there. Okay, you guys, we are back at the house. And, uh, yeah, we uh, got skunked on catfish. I will admit... This is the first time I've ever had to purchase catfish. But look at these fillets. They almost look like crappie fillets or bass. It's like real white. No bloodline throughout it. No blood on it. So, got the grease going. I turned it down once it got the temperature. And I'm gonna drop these fillets. I got them wet a little bit, so I didn't use like a egg wash or anything to make this seasoning stick. I'll just put one in there.
Okay. Take it off. Look at it. I guess I should have put some paper towels down on that. <laughs> Make sure it's done. Does that look done to you? I think so. It looks done to me. But it was pretty white before, so. <laughs> okay, I just tried it. I didn't do it on camera because I thought maybe it was not cooked all the way. It is dang good. Yes, sir. Hudson! Hey, you want to try some fish? I see how it tastes from tin. Yeah. You're gonna have to blow it. Way better than I thought. Honestly. Zero to ten. Ten to eighty five. So it's very good. So it's very good? Oh my gosh. Hey, you know the good thing about not catching any catfish is I didn't have to clean any catfish. I can't get my meat to come out that white. I mean, there's no blood through it. It's just as pure white as any other like crappie, bass. Uh, so I've got to learn how to bleed them out completely and get it that pure white. Me buying the trout or the catfish today show me that it can look that white. But um, this is kind of like our appetizer because she's cooking soup. But um, let me know what you think of today's video, how you guys catch your catfish, because obviously we gotta, we gotta give that another run. But I like it. It's really good. I'm not, I mean, I would tell you if it sucked, but it's, it's really good. Let me know what you think of today's video. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Come back, see us on the next adventure, and we'll see you guys on the next one.